Hi guys, it's Mogi Biggie and Life is Strange Before the Storm Episode 2. Brave New World has just been released. I think it came out two days ago, so we're going to get straight into this. I uploaded the first episode, full episode, on my channel um, two or three months ago when it first came out. And it was really, really successful. So we are playing Episode Previously, 2, Brave New World. And I was about to say, this is what happened on the first Life is Strange. Is playing a show we're also playing as Rachel this time. I'm going to teach this little punk some manners. Hey, dickhead. Get the fuck out of here. Between your grades and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. I'm worried. We don't have to like each other, but you will respect me. Hello, Black Hell. Chloe, do something! Hey, do you know if Rachel is a gamer? How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Don't be surprised, Chloe, if one day I'm just out of here. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Damn, they are really going at it. You yeah. remember that guy that we saw under this tree? This is where it goes down. That was my dad. And then just. And that woman was definitely not my mom. Yeah, they caused quite a wildfire. Yeah. So it was a very good uh, first episode. The ending was a bit abrupt. Didn't really expect it, but where are we? We're in the principal's office by the looks of it. I think we are. Who's this? Is this Chloe? Here you go. Miss Price, how good of you to join us. I'm so sorry we're late. My my shift ran late at the diner and then we're just sorry. Let us proceed. One of you here is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process. And the other Me. is all too familiar with it. Yeah. Blackwell's code of conduct is built upon a foundation of mutual respect meant to foster an environment conducive to education and enrichment. When that respect okay. is violated... Reality check time. Yesterday did actually happen. I ditched school with Rachel Amber, and then Rachel really did start that fire. And that was after we actually agreed to run away from here. I don't know if the principal knows it was right? us who set fire to the Are you the paying whole attention to town? me, Chloe? Um, I'm not what? sure. Miss Price, the last time we met, an agreement was brokered. Do you recall what that was? No. Um, don't screw up, I'm assuming. Uh don't get in trouble again trouble is merely the byproduct miss price what's at issue is your attitude we agreed that you would rededicate yourself to becoming an exemplary blackwell citizen we did did we <laughs> can't remember in the that. event that you were unable or unwilling to do so we also agreed that it would become pertinent to Super reassess guys. your future Kick status down. at the academy despite all this you engaged in the following actions yesterday in the language witnesses saying you were involved in bullying nathan prescott well. if involved means not sticking out my neck for blackwell's richest ass child i didn't realize that was a crime your lack of awareness does not absolve you of anything miss price say what you will about my daughter but she is not a bully Maybe you should be talking to Drew instead of me. You know, the guy who actually did what you're accusing me of. Mr. North's situation requires sensitivity. It will be handled separately. Um, reassure Mom. Mom, you know this is all bullshit, right? Chloe, now is not the time. Cut. <laughs> and yet, even with your prodigious disciplinary record, Miss Price, we needn't discuss any of it. We needn't? No, because you severed your relationship with Blackwell the minute you left school grounds without permission. I felt ill. I wanted to go home. What does that mean? It means... 
You forced my hand. Are we literally getting kicked out? This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. I have no choice I but to suspend. Okay. What? 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 Yesterday was what? all me. My idea. I was having a bad day. I needed to blow off some steam and I took it too far. Chloe tried to talk me out of it. I've been down that road, she told me. You're better than this. This is good acting. This is a uh, good acting. See, Chloe was afraid I'd get in trouble or hurt, so she came with emotional? me. But only keep to safe? keep me safe. <laughs> I'm just sorry what? you got caught up in it, Chloe. That you allowed me to drag you down yeah. to my level. It's all right. Don't mention it. Got some. Uh, got some time off school. Yeah. Sure. Got to Where's sit it? on a moving Thank train, you. watch a fire. I'll make it up to you. I promise. Burn the whole village down. Chloe, is this true? It's true. Totally not true. Totally. She really is an amazing actress. Incredible acting, actress. to be fair. Beautifully done. This price. Yeah, fine. Fine, yes. It was her idea. But it's not like she kidnapped me. We were in it together. From day one. Miss Amber, based on what you've just told me, I have grounds to punish you. Are you sure what you've told me is the truth? Yes. This can't be the full story, Rachel. Wow. Ray. Ray. Just to be clear, Miss Amber, you're sure Chloe Price didn't coerce All right, you didn't leave her. Worse her. What are you doing? I'm just trying to get to the bottom of why someone like Rachel. Oh, I think we're clear, Principal Wells. Someone, someone like, like Rachel, Rachel, but not my daughter. Bang. Excuse me? Yeah, I'm shutting you down. Do you have a list of students you assume the worst about? Yeah, it's in my uh, top drawer. Go, Mom. You have no right to treat Chloe this way. This is because she's on financial aid, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> I get it. This is about Blackwell's money troubles. Will you be dragging every other scholarship student into your office today as well? Damn. One nail. Let's all just calm down. After everything we... She's been through in the last two years. You should be ashamed of yourself. Miss Price. Here we go. Mrs. Price. Mrs. Price. I appreciate Fine. your position, but I assure you, it is only your daughter's past behavior that has led us here today. I understand, Mr. Wells. There is no doubt that Chloe's behavior must improve. But Upset given what we've just yeah. learned about the negative influence she was under, I hope you will allow her just one Look more Look at this chance. actor as well. Come on, one more Ms. chance, Amber, Wells. I Come am on. as surprised as I am disappointed in you. I understand. This being your first infraction in no way reduces its severity. Still, we will not be suspending you at this time. But well, you have squandered it. our trust. You will no longer be my administrative assistant first period. And you will no longer be involved in Blackwell's performance. Oh no, text. that's a drama thing. I hope that oh. train ride was worth it. <sighs> what? Uh, the performance is tonight. But the performance is tonight. Who are they going to replace With it with? someone so aware of our school calendar, Miss Price, I would expect fewer absences on your record. What? Well, Ray, hey, don't shut me down. That show. Since this is her first infraction, Mr. Don't you Amber, think, uh... I don't tell you how to run the district attorney's office. Please don't tell me how to run my school. Okay. Is There's that what you wanted? There's a reason we have understudies for all circumstances. Accidental and deliberate. I'm sure your understudy. Victoria Chase. Yes. Oh, I'm sure Victoria Chase Victoria. will do Victoria. That is no. such... What is that, Miss Price? No one Chloe likes Victoria. is upset for her friend, but we are both grateful that she is not going to be unduly blamed for what happened. There is plenty of blame to go around. Chloe's future at Blackwell will be discussed next. Unless you had something to add first, Miss Price. Yeah, we burned down the forest. You know that fire yesterday? It was us. It was a Oh, shit. Go along with Rachel. Take the blame. Thank you, Rachel. I owe you one. No. I owe you one. Don't you worry. I'm glad. 
that Although that did Chloe affect may not have been the, the mastermind story. of yesterday's events it was as i prefaced the proverbial last straw in light of your many past transgressions what i have no choice but to suspend you for the rest of the year but it was the other girl's idea she confessed oh this principal was oh, i don't like him does not absolve chloe of her responsibility I am truly sorry it has come to this. It was, but Chloe it, will have the chance for reinstatement in the fall. Her actions beginning now will be weighed heavily in that decision. Do wow. you understand me? Both of you. Uh, yeah, I guess. Yeah. I mean, as much as I ever do. Chloe? Wow. You just let me the whole year. Mr. Wells. I will have Skip oh, Matthews escort you to clean out your locker. Skip, you may skip. wait outside my office until he arrives. No, just leave now. That Don't need my stuff. Good day. Don't need my pencil case anymore. Sorry, Mister and Mrs. Amber. Ray. 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 Come on, Chloe. It's because of all Jane Doe top, isn't it? You don't believe in uh in Jane Doe. You do not gun free zone. I'm sorry. Okay, then. I'm sorry too. Meet me at the junkyard later. You bet. The junkyard. Is this going to be like some huge? I didn't get debate? the chance to introduce myself. I'm, I'm Joyce. Joyce. Mrs. Price. I'm Rose. This is James. I'm sorry we had to meet like this. No, I'm sorry. I'm sure for you this is an unusual circumstance. We really should be going. Nice to meet you. As if no one knows about this huge fire that we uh, we caused as well. In the parking lot. That's quite funny. Like the imagine the hey, shit we get for that. I'm supposed to walk you out. Just you and me, hey Skip. You know I was supposed to have today off, right? Oh. Sorry that my totally fair and impartial hearing inconvenienced you, man. Fair, you'd be getting paid for this, so it's not all doom and gloom. What, what's in a locker really of any significance, any anyway? Except my secret stash. Hold on. Close him down. Thank you. Might as well grab my emergency joint while I'm here. Yeah, I think you might. You might as well grab that. Why, why, why do you have a photo of a cat? Is this your cat? We're just going to take it anyway. Look at that. I mean, you don't expect someone like Chloe to have a picture of a cat in a locker. Let's throw the homework away. That was due last period as well. Why do you have to stand so far back? Is it privacy or something? Sorry, what does this say? Hey, oh, we're going to get an achievement. I think this is graffiti. Oh no, what she actually wrote? Chloe Price, 10, almost. Um, we're going to take the doodle book. Pretty pointlessly again. We chemistry book, we won't need that. Bin that. What else? Yeah, we'll we'll bin this book as well. Don't feel we'll be coming back here in a hurry. Oh, did you want that skip? Did you want that book? Looks like you're very interested. This English book. It's also gone in the bin. What even is this at the back? Is that some music thing? Was it comic? No, or a poster or something. And well, that's in the bin. Retrieve. There you go. The last joint. Don't get caught. You're not going to get caught, are you? Just picking up the Check joint. Pot. Yeah. Put it. Put it away. Wait. What the hell? What? Damn it, Justin. Chloe, hey, I had to borrow your stats. Desperate times, you know. I promise I'll get it back to you next week, Justin. No, so he's taking it. Oh, that's 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 upset Fuck Chloe the most. Inch of this place. I wish I could tag it from floor to ceiling, but with Skip watching me. Slam, we're done. Uh, out of the bathroom. Then I'm out. Cool. <sighs> okay, but try to make it fast, will you? All right, Skip. Calm down. All you have to do is stand and watch me empty a locker. 
don't know why this music kicked in. Please don't be copyright, please. Just like in the first episode. It's graffiti everywhere. What, what are you going to write? Okay, um, you're just going for some graffiti session, we, we get it. A bit unstable, that is, that's a good drawing to be fair though. Um, yeah, look at that from the butterfly effect right there. That's a foreshadowing. Wow, okay, we've got a tree. Woman take forever. You're going to break the glass as well? There will be consequences. They said something about Max then. What are you doing? You're going for a... Where are you going? You're backflip. I'm leaving Rachel. This doesn't really happen in England. No one really graffitis a whole bathroom because they got kicked out. But you know, it's a brave new world now. What are you going to do to the toilet, right? You're just going to write up all the walls again? What are you going to write? None of this has had any reference or anything. We've just graffitied everything. You're trying too hard. You're pathetic. Crazy freak. Bitch. I don't like your attitude. How do you remember all these quotes? English must be your first choice. Oh, there's Victoria. Hey, Victoria. Oh, my God. What? So, Victoria's obviously taken Rachel's place in that play whatever the play was but there we go we are we officially kicked out of Blackwell obviously in the first season of Life is Strange we were playing as Max but Rachel no Chloe sorry had already been kicked out of Blackwell so this is where it sort of started why, why is there a Bigfoot mask in the back of the van a movie prop is just where they pull Bigfoot imagine it did hunting for those Sasquatch later skip goodbye Later. Next time you go in the girl's bathroom, just so you know it wasn't me. There he is, action man. Looks like David's here. Yeah. Awesome. But we've got a, we've Another got a text. To Max. That I'll never send. At least Journal Max won't abandon me the way real Max did. Shit. Right, let's read this. When do you? When did you decide you were done with me? I mean, how did you know it was time to move on? I asked because Rachel and I have decided we're done with this shit town. We've had it. It's bye bye bay. But instead of just ghosting it like someone we know, we're going to leave a trail of destruction in our wake. Yeah, that's always the best idea. For Rachel, that means burning a freaking forest down. I have I know, crazy, but guess what? I'm crazy too. I'm not... Unrelated news. I finally got ass suspended from Blackwell. Is that, is that something to celebrate for? I really don't know. And Rachel got booted from a play, which strangely sucks even worse. I should probably be more upset about being a high school dropout, but I'm not. It's just another chapter of a fuckery in the story of my life. So yeah, burning bridges literally and academically, that's how you make an exit woman. Chloe, the exit wonder. Okay, so what was this text? We got a lot of text to go through. We got two from Mum. Uh, um, um, again, Chloe, really? Chloe, you can't keep doing this to me. I'm trying my best. Yeah, how do we go back? Um, text from Elliot. Hey, after Tempest, you want to hang out? Well, we won't be seeing that show anymore. We're kicked out. Um, how, how are we replicants going to stick together? These are such pointless texts. Urgent. Fire weather update. Arcadia Bay Forest Watch. Arcadia Bay. Uh, active Class D wildfire, not contained, use caution, check local media for road closures. Yeah, sorry about that. Um, you're hella weird, you are, seriously, we'll get revenge. Are these like really old texts? Why has he got my phone number? Why is he just texting? It's a bit strange, isn't it, Principal Wells? I know you're a bit weird in Season 1, but come on, mate. Please utilise caution while travelling to and from campus facility. Faculty and staff have been asked to... Wave punctuality requirements for all sports and extra curricular activities this weekend. Okay, well they were pretty pointless texts, but anyway, what's this announcement say? Max would have loved this shit. The future needs excellence. Because of a generous grant from the Prescott Foundation, Blackwell will be offering several new courses next fall designed to nurture the artistic gifts of its students. 
visual concepts, intro to composition, intro to ceramics, intermediate photoshop, intro to char character modeling and animation, photoshop independent study. Special thanks to Caroline Prescott. Okay. Let's let's leave Blackwell. Like, like what why is this mask taking in the back of a car? Blackwell Athletics means taking pride in yourself. Also, the trustees and their enormous bank accounts. Yeah, I mean, don't really know why you have At that in the back of your van. Plenty of free time to take up skateboarding again. Just take that one. If I feel like Here it. Here is action man. It's How are you doing? Damn time. David, please. Right, Dave. How's the whip? How's the army? Chloe, your How mother you? and I have been talking. I don't care. I don't care. I know. That's what we need to talk about. I oh, David I just really annoys me. Like, not with so, such an asshat here. I just so need annoying. Space. Do not use that language with your mother. Such an asshat. <laughs> or what? Or what, David? What will you do? Beat you to the ground. You do not want to test me. Maybe if you try listening to me. Oh, David, just shut up. Me about everything. You might actually learn a thing or two. No. What? How to be a soldier? Soldiers put family and future above self and now. Getting kicked out of school? That's, That's what, what losers, losers do. do. Back in my day. You had a scholarship, oh, Chloe. The past. Do you know what that means? What kind of opportunity you gave up? Do you want to work at the diner? Oh, not mind, to be fair. Can I get our uh, weekends off, please? Someone needed my help. Someone needed my help. Who? Your Jane friend Dye. Rachel? Because I think the daughter of the DA is going to be just fine. I need your help. Me, your mother. We need to get our own house in order. Right now, what I need most of all is for the two of you to start getting well, along. Well, that's not happening. We've got the action man over Chloe, here. Look at him. I don't oh, want you to just fight. want to headbutt him I and lob him down the drain. Much. Well, I do and anyway. You too. I'd like for us to start over. over. What do you say? What do you say, pal? Sure. Sure. Oh, that that affected it. Reset button. Shit. Pets. Illuminati I signal affected the future. From now on. I will be assisting your mother in a few areas. Like what? Like making sure that you are no longer abusing drugs or alcohol. Abusing is a strong word. David, do you really think now is the right time? Yeah, come on, Dave. Please, we must be a united. Oh, uh, shut up! You're not even my dad. Mom. Chloe, I'd like you to empty your pockets and place all your belongings on the trunk of the car. Nope. What the fuck? We are not we are in the army anymore, over. Dave. We have to know that you are not abusing drugs. If you're not, you should be eager for the chance to prove it. Mom, you saw how I was treated in there. Now you want to treat me the same way? Come on, Joyce, I don't need step more up. Discipline from you. I want to hear I your voice. I know, Chloe, and I'm sorry, but David feels. Oh, shut up, David, David, David. We feel. This is the best Dave way to start the rave. Fresh. Just do one. Let's please. go, Chloe. Quit stalling. <laughs> Quit stalling. We have a joint in our pocket, don't we? Refuse. No, we've got a joint in our pocket. Bye. See you later. I've refused. That again affected the story, but I'm not about sure. this one. Here you go. Show me a warrant, asshole. That's right. You Bang. Watch too much television. Your refusal to comply is as good as an admission. I admit to you being a fascist, and I don't take orders from fascists. What happened to trust being a two-way street? That was before you were suspended. But it wasn't my fault. I know you it haven't always been me. treated fairly, and I'm not trying to add to that, but Chloe Somewhere along the way, Chloe. we lost our trust. This is not the way to get it back. Not at all. Okay. That's it? She's basically admitted her guilt, and you're letting her off the hook? I am not letting her off the hook. I am trying to find a way for us to move on. We need a new beginning. A new chapter. 
one that will involve the three of us together. Yay, like what a does happy that family. We both agree. Right. Okay, the here we go. The best thing for everyone at this stage is for me to No, move no it in. isn't. I can't stand you and you've been in this episode 5 no minutes. No fucking way. Do Chloe, one, after Dave. everything that's happened. Uh, I'm at a loss. I need help. Exactly. No, not Dave. Need a Look at him. Hand steering this ship. the action man over to here. Me, Chloe. Tell me what you're feeling. Tell me. Tell me, Chloe. I know I fucked up. You're trying. I get it. You're trying. I want to. You're trying. I don't want to hate on my mum, but I can't stand I David. And I've been making. I'm it sure all of you agree that David's just an arsehole. But Dickhead. this is not the answer. It's the only answer I have, Chloe. Really? In a million years, I never thought you'd choose David over me. I'm sorry I took that for granted. Pretty I'm hard. not choosing anyone over anyone else. It's about the three of us having a home together. It'll be better than you think, Chloe. Once no everything's running smoothly, you'll see what a stable home can be like. Yeah, we knew that before my dad died. That was stable, we used to get on, have banter, and then you got bloody action man moved in, and it all went downhill. All went bloody downhill. Like, look, we're getting in this car, can we just walk home, get the bus, get an Uber home? Be easier than, than this. Hey! What are you doing? There is no home. Not if he's there. No, we're not going. We're walking, we're getting a bus. Chloe. Let her go. Bye. She'll come home as soon as her tantrum is over. David, just... You're really getting on my nerves. Just stop getting involved, please. Please, David. Do us all a favour and go back to the army or the navy or the military or wherever you came from. The depths despair. Are you hung upside down? I swear you are. How do you know which way is up when your whole life has been turned upside down? Well, uh, gravity sort of helps you with that answer. I uh, the seal's in hand there. What are you actually resting on? A lamppost? Black Hole's done with me. I can't go home anymore. Is this junkyard all I've got left? We've got Max. Ring Max up. Get Max back here. Holler at her and she'll come back and then it'll be all happy families. Swing, go on. Swing. You're not going for it. You don't want to break the the van, the car. What are you going to do? Looks like she got an idea. How is the car unlocked? How have you just managed to open Ugh. up the bonnet? I don't really know what she's planning to do. You've lost me here, Chloe. This thing is a mess. But maybe I can fix it. Just why? If well, this beast will ever run again, the first thing it needs is a new battery. Why would there be a random new battery in a, an old here. abandoned scrapyard? I'm not really sure, to be fair. We, we did get a text also, though, from Mum. 
Maybe I need my daughter back. Maybe, maybe you do. Why are we going to find an old battery in here? Like, I don't think... Is that an Elvis... An Elvis pop figure? We're taking that. That can go in the front of the car. Is it... Is it actually Elvis? It is. There you go. Just because... Don't really know why that was here. But anyway, right. So, there's Dad's car. What a beautiful car. Right, where would a car battery be? Where would a car battery be? A camera? Any sick photos on here? Sorry, Max. I think I'm more jealous of you than anything. Hopefully, I'll be escaping this uh, place. Look, there's a lens next to... to it. Let's take the lens. There was a lens next... Oh, there it is. Right, where is a car battery? Open this hood bonnet and we'll, we'll take this battery. There you go. Will this one work? This is no good. No. For some reason it's no good. Like seriously, are you actually hoping to find a fully functional car battery in a scrapyard? Because I don't really know the, the chances of that happening. What, why is there Christmas lights in a chair? You gotta love a place where even Christmas looks depressing. Where is... Posters? No, this is a Vortex Club. I wouldn't mind joining. Outcast Unite. No, you're alright. Well, there's a putting green. Blimey, look at this. You've got a mini golf session going on over here. Fire poker, we can't even... Can we actually get into this? We'll turn this radio on. Why? Please don't be copyright music. Nah, it seems copyrighted. I'm, I'm guessing. No, sorry, sorry. Turn off. There you go. Just in case. Right, with this car. No, we can't even get into this boot with the car. Actually, which car? This one. Can we get into this bat? Nope. Where's the car battery? Where's the car battery? That's Dad's car. We're not taking his battery. He's not going to need it. He's not going to need it. Where is a car battery? School bus. Surely there'll be a battery inside the school bus. I wonder if I'll bus. ever ride one of these again. Probably not, because you've, you've passed your driving test, surely. Um, literally... Where is this battery? There's a shrink. Here's the side of Arcadia Bay they don't put on the postcards. Yeah. Wow, this, this is like a new car. Please notice wow. what's it say. <laughs> Shitty ride, drug dealer. Really thought crime paid better. Warning, this vehicle has been seized and impounded in execution of a warrant order. This vehicle is restrained and impounded in the accordance with the authority provided by Rule 42 of the Oregon Magistrates Court Rules in a Persons of Section 2 of the Narcotics Damage Act of 1985 it is an offence to, without lawful excuse, destroy, damage, or tamper with this property. I mean, it's not actually that nice, uh, that horrible car. It's pretty, pretty nice, right? Do you what have you a battery in there? Is it locked? Well, the hood is locked, so that's that works. That's really good. We're going to have to unlock it from that button, which is right there. Uh, there's no door on it because that is that's really normal. Right, surely there's a spare battery in here. A battery we can use. There you go. Here we go. Did you did yeah, you really need to wipe your hands after that? In a brand new battery in a brand new car, and you still felt the need to wipe your hands. Where's she even hook this battery on? What pockets have you just put a bloody dench battery in? Have you? Did you just lob it over at the car? Because that would damage it. Because I don't see a battery on your body anywhere. Really don't. And also an Elvis pop figure. Where did you get that from? Where have you hidden that? Oh, there you go. It's in your hands now. Just unlimited uh, invisible bag.
I don't know what. Okay, shit. I was about to say I don't know what she's trying to hope to achieve by doing this, but looks like it won't even be achieved. There you go. Bang. There you go. Fresh in the brand new whip. We literally planned to like hotwire everything. Surely it's not going to be able to hotwire with a a screwdriver. No, as uh, I'm about but to yeah. say. This thing needs more love than I can give right now. In the meantime, maybe I can spruce it up a bit. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, there you go. We need to put the Elvis statue on here. How does that affect the future? Does it smack into your head while crash while crashing or something? You can hang here, but I get to pick the tunes. Okay? Good Don't talk. Don't know how that uh, affects anything in this storyline, but we will continue. Um, let's look at this torn floor ward. While an escape hatch could be nice, I should probably cover over this massive hole. And what about this? Probably a good idea to cover over this with something. Yes. Why do you sound so weird? I bet if I look, I can find something else to fix inside the truck. Okay, a broken bulb. Maybe there's another light bulb I can put. Do we really need to look for like a light bulb, a rug, and something to cover up that hole? Really? Because that is more effort than I can be asked to okay. do. Okay. Let's see what else this trash heap has to offer. Something to cover up a hole. Any of these? No. A mannequin's head. Could just like kick it. No. No. Anything here? I guarantee I walked past what I could have used about five minutes ago before trying to find that. There you go. There's a light bulb. You before trying to find work. that. Then again. That battery. I hardly ever work. We found one though. Don't know what the chances are that it'll actually work or fit, but we will ignore that situation. Anything here? Anything here? Place them out. There you go. So, surely that's. I hear surely we can use that. Up the diner with mom before school. No, obviously. We, I guess those days. Why can we not use that over. place mat? There you go. We're going to take a welcome mat instead. You okay, should two out of cover three. that life-endangering floor hole quite nicely. It's only endangering on the passenger. You'll be driving, so it shouldn't really affect you. So, won't really worry about it. Wait, what else do we need to find? Something to cover the seats. So I assume like a blanket or a carpet or something. I don't really know. Hopefully, I can find it pretty quick though. Anything around here? A bat? No. A toy robot? So Why is this here? Till this guy enslaves everyone. Yeah. What's what's this? These magazines are so gross. What the bloody hell! Who would Fun look with at candy. This? Um. Yeah. Let's just. The weird, weird things you find in an abandoned scrapyard, apparently. Take, there you go, here it is. It would have a this skull and crossbones on, wouldn't it? cover for that torn seat. Okay, again, in the invisible bag of Chloe Price. Need to get one of those. Really, really helpful in games like this. And then we'll put it in this van, and then I think we will end the episode here. I... If you've not noticed, I do about half an hour episodes on games like this. This has ran over slightly, I'll, I think. But there you go, we'll fix this up quickly. Putting on this blanket of pirateness. Yeah, it looks much better now. Incredible. Don't even know where you got that duct tape from, but we're gonna. We're not gonna question that. We've got the welcome mat. 
because why not? And then we got the light bulb. Look, you, you've missed half the crack. You failed there, Chloe. I'm sorry, but you failed. Let's fix this light bulb. Don't know, in real life, the chances of it would be the right light bulb, but there you go. Video game logic. We now have a working car. This thing hopefully. looks like a rusted out shopping cart. Probably drives like one, too. If I ever That's get started. That's if it ever does drive, which seems questionable. Still, how sweet would that be? It would be pretty sweet. Come on. Hello? Is it Max? Is it Rachel? Is it Action Man? Who is it? Yeah. Frank. It's Frank. Oh. Hey, Frank. What's up? Yeah, just checking in to see how you're doing. Really? You want the money? No. Listen, we've got some business to discuss. Where can we meet? What about... Oh, like... Drugs? Christ. I'm hanging out in the junkyard, north of town. A junkyard. That's Bit of a sketchy place to meet. Okay. Don't you think? And Frank? I bet it's hung up. Is that thing cool? I'm not in trouble or anything. Right? Yeah, I yeah, am. Yeah. I don't know. Did you do anything you should be in trouble for? <laughs> like, in general? Or to you? Both. Okay. And on that note, we are probably going to end the episode here. We've got Frank on our back, which obviously won't be good news. Really, really won't be. Because. Time for a hard-earned smoke break. There you go. Right, we're going to end this episode here. I don't think that will be good news because at the end of the first episode of Life is Strange, you do see someone banging on the door and they're shouting where's my money and it sounded like Frank so I think perhaps Frank's acting nice and then he's gonna threaten to kill us because he had beef with Chloe and Max in the first season of Life is Strange it's so awkward because the first season well this is a prequel to the first season so it's really weird to how to word it but though they just hated each other basically and we ended up killing his dog, which is lovely to see. But hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, then smash the like button. Leave in the comments down below if you're enjoying this episode so far. And if you want me to keep them at about half an hour episodes, I imagine episode 2 of This Life is Strange is probably going to be about an hour and a half to two hours like the others have been. But hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, also click that subscribe button. That will really, really help my channel. I've started a new game on my channel called Oxen Free, which is a really, really good indie game as well and i played a game yesterday called gone home but thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed this and i'm really enjoying it so far it's really really good obviously the intro half an hour not a lot really ever happens on life is strange but i assume as soon as they find out the wildfire was us or we helped cause it then shit is going to really hit the fan but anyway guys thank you for watching and see ya